Hi, Miranda and I, Michelle, are here to talk to you about traveling with your pet birds. And apparently she would love to get into her carrier. She's not, doesn't want to talk about it. She is a doer. And here we go. She's going to get her tail wrapped around. She loves getting into her carrier. And you can see that the first thing you want to do is get your bird where they are happy about getting in their carrier. So you might want to start the first thing you're going to do before you go on a traveling with them is get them in their carrier, take them someplace fun. You might even just take them for a car ride and let them go. And let's go through some traveling with your pet birds because we all know that it's fun. Whether you're planning a short trip or a longer vacation, if you have a pet parrot, you'll need to take some special considerations into account. Here are eight more tips on how to travel safely with your pet bird. Before you hit the road, Make sure your bird is healthy and up to date on all its interstate health requirements. Check with your avian veterinarian on what documentation you need if crossing state lines. You'll also need to get a travel cage or carrier that's large enough for your bird to move around comfortably, but not so big that it's unsafe. Never have your parrot roaming freely in the car. Accidents can and will happen. Deployed airbags have killed pet birds roaming freely in vehicles. When packing your bird's travel cage or carrier, include some of your bird's favorite toys and snacks to help them feel comfortable and calm during the journey. Apples and oranges are great in their travel cages to provide both fluid and food. Make sure you have enough of your pet bird's food and water to last the trip. You never know if you will be able to find it when your final destination or if you have some car trouble along the way. It's always a good idea to pack a few extra paper towels or a small hand towel in case of accident. I usually have a little basket on the floorboards of my car. When you're ready to hit the road, keep the travel cage in a safe and secure place. The back seat is preferred or in the back of the RV. Strap your bird in with a seat belt or bungee cord. If you're flying, check with your airlines ahead of time to find out their specific requirements for traveling with a pet bird. The airline's requirements change all the time and it's always good to check each trip. With a little planning and preparation, traveling with your pet bird can be both fun and memorable experience for both of you, whether it's a weekend or a long road trip. Thank you for watching Miranda and I. Please like, subscribe, and share so we can continue helping you and your feather friends live long, happy lives together. You can also check out our website at coopshop.com. Bye-bye.